Seminars for me are a source of inspiration. You get to work with people that you don't normally work with. You get to see teachers that you don't normally get to see. Um, if you're going through a lull, it really helps to boost your practice. I like seminars a lot uh, because it gets you the chance to train with people that you may never have trained with ever before, or that you may have trained with prior but don't train with very often. And you get to kind of gauge yourself, I think, a little more accurately uh, in terms of like how your chemi is, how your connection is, things like that. It gives you kind of a fresh look or a fresh perspective. You'll be training your own instructor and that's fantastic but sometimes to learn a certain point or a certain thing you need you know another set of eyes on you or or another perspective on the technique so it really helps you to grow uh, within the study of Aikido. I know that at seminars I've heard a teacher say a concept in a different way that my teacher has been pounding into me for the last six months and I finally get it. Uh, seminars um, are very important uh, within Aikido both for the organization as a whole and for the individual member. Yeah, it's great because it, like, you, 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 know, you foster bonds with people you start to and maintains it. Uh, not just the seminars really, but the, the overall art that you're trying to preserve. And you can't really maintain it, but you're just staying at home all the time. <laughs> it's really wonderful to be able to foster those relationships with different people in Aikido in different locations, in different places, people who study with different people, and as a whole I think it just enriches one's Aikido experience as a whole. Aikido for me has become a way of life. Uh, it focused me after uh, undergrad. I didn't know what I was going to do. Um, and it just gave me a path. Yeah, I think uh, since taking up practice, I've been able to be more patient and understanding with people, uh, more compassionate. In the, in the whole stretch of it, you have the ability to either be really, really compassionate or extremely devastatingly brutal if you want it to be. So I highly encourage everyone to go to seminars. It's not just about teachers being able to go out and see new dojos, see new places, but it's also important for students to go to wherever these seminars are being held and to experience it. We have an endowment fund that they've recently started and it's to help with seminars, uh, to host them for you know, the senseis and Pretty much anything that can benefit the community endowment fund is going towards. You're benefiting not just yourself, but anybody else. So realistically, we all help each other. And that's what we're trying to foster. So the endowment fund is a great fundraising opportunity for these seminars to happen. Uh, it's so important that we continue to share ideas and continue to build a community and build our practice. So please donate and help these seminars to occur. My name is Shawna Keeley and I train with Clallam County Aikikai in Washington State. My name is James Medlica. I train out of Albuquerque, New Mexico. I'm out of Aikido of Albuquerque. My name is Michelle Rudeau and I practice at Aikido of Albuquerque.